Hello beautiful people from the internet, it is Connie over here and today I am letting y'all sit in my driver's seat, alright? You are in the spot where I usually drive my car because it is the only spot that has a steering wheel and pedals so you can drive it if you want, it's gonna be a little hard but today we are trying a new camera angle and also a new microphone so you can call this a test trial video but I'm not gonna call that because we're professional over here so this is an experiment scientific one and today I'm gonna be chatting about how I've been spending more money on cigarettes which is something that I always said I was not gonna do because I was very set on the amount I wanted to spend a month and I was not gonna spend any more than that and guess what life happens so we're gonna light up a little Camel Activate which is one of my last ones and I'm gonna buy a new pack after one of these days and we're just gonna be chatting about it so let's go let's light this up Maybe I'll open my door a little bit. I don't know. Maybe I'll fall behind. We'll see. It's okay. If I find if I fall then I fell. Anyway, so basically I'm gonna update you. If you're new on this channel, hello. I am Connie and I smoke one cigarette a day. Sometimes I forget to smoke and I smoke one cigarette every two days or every three days. Um, so I don't spend very much money on cigarettes. That is for sure. And when I started smoking, I had this policy with myself of I need to only buy one pack a month and I need to finish the whole pack to the last cigarette until I can buy a new one. And I thought that was a really nice policy to live by, you know, I would be rich forever, <laughs> just kidding, I would at least save my other five euros a month, um, and I would smoke a whole pack, have discipline within myself, and only buy a new one after I finished the last cigarette of the, the pack that I was smoking. Is this even recording? Let me check. Man, I don't trust myself to turn these things on. I am always having to check if I'm recording the video or not. Because I really, I really don't trust myself to hit the record button. And this has happened before, alright? I've recorded whole videos that then were not recorded because I was not recording them. Anyway, just funny things. But, so that was basically my policy for a long time while I was smoking for at least the first year, honestly. And then, I discovered Marlboro Silver Blues. Marlboro Silver Blues were the cigarettes that changed my mind. And this happened because... I bought the pack of Marlboro Silver Blues and I hated them so much, so much, that I was like, how am I gonna smoke this whole shitty pack until I buy a new one? No offense to those who really love Marlboro Silver Blues, I don't even know if they exist in America, but the, I live in Europe, Portugal, so I found them here. I don't know if they exist in America or not, alright? Basically, I found that pack, it was so bad that I was like, this policy ends here because I will not finish this pack and I will buy a new one right now or else I'll just quit smoking. If I have to smoke Marlboro Silver Blues, I might as well quit, you know? I think those are the only cigarettes that if you told me, would you rather quit cigarettes or only smoke Marlboro Silver Blues for the rest of your life? I'm quitting right now, all right? Those cigarettes are absolutely horrendous to me. Uh, I don't know why. Maybe I just hate them because I hate them, but the flavor, it's... I don't like them. So, I bought the pack of Marlboro Silver Blues, I smoked two cigarettes and I bought a new pack. I don't know which pack I bought after, but that was the first time I broke my rule of only one pack a month. And eventually I even lost a pack of Marlboro Silver Blues, so there's a whole pack full of cigarettes somewhere in the world and it's not with me, thankfully, because I was not going to smoke them, you know? But yeah, so basically I was spending around 5 euros a month on cigarettes. Some cigarette packs over here are as cheap as 4 euros and 30 cents, like some Chesterfields and West Originals. Chesterfields, Chesterfields are like 4 euros and 80 cents. And some packs go as expensive as Marlboro Reds as 5 euros and 50 cents, or Marlboro Golds on 5 euros and 30 cents, stuff like that, you know? So I was spending around 5 euros on cigarettes a month. And then I got bored and I decided to start experimenting with new packs and cigarillos and stuff like that. So basically now I always have a pack of cigarettes and a pack of cigarillos on me, at least, because I like to alternate between cigarettes and cigarillos. So I'm at least spending 10 euros a month on cigarettes because I'm buying those too. And cigarillos are actually quite cheap. This pack of uh, 17 Chesterfield cigarillo cost me 2 euros and 90 cents. Look at that. Can you see it? I don't know if the phone will focus, but you know, I tried. So on average, I'm spending around 10 euros because I'm gonna count the packs of cigarillos as five euros because there's some pack of cigarillos that are more expensive than just two euros, but they're average, like way cheaper than normal cigarettes. I don't know why, I actually like cigarillos more, but watch my last video to see more about that. Oh my God, I'm such a YouTuber. No, 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 I'm not gonna do that. Don't watch anything. 
I'm shaking, interesting. But then came a point about a month ago where I had like four packs of different things on me because I just get so bored so quickly with everything in general and cigarettes as well that I just have to always be trying something new or else I'm like, man, what is the point of all of this? You know, I'm bored. I want something new to try. Sometimes I don't want to smoke a Camel Activate. So if I only have that pack, I'm stuck with that cigarette. So now I'm spending around I would say 10 euros is the average, but some months I would spend 15 because I would have two different kinds of cigarettes and then a uh, cigarillo, you know? So I usually have like a strong cigarette, a soft cigarette, light cigarette in a cigarillo pack. So I would say that the average right now has gone from 5 to 10 to 15, depending on if I have two packs of cigarettes or only one, you know? Because cigarillos, I always have a pack and cigarettes as well, but sometimes I can have two packs of cigarettes and one of cigarillos. And I just said the word cigarette so many times, oh my God. That is basically how much I'm spending on cigarettes a month, which, you know what, I, I don't mind it. I don't mind it at all. I mean, if I have different kinds for me to try, if I never get bored with it, just always like having like just different types of flavors that I can have. If I'm bored with a strong cigarette, I have a Camel Activate. It has a mentally light flavor to it. If I'm bored with the cigarillos, then I have cigarettes, you know? It's, it's just a good dynamic that I'm loving. So today I was actually not planning on recording a video because it has been raining, pouring rain the whole day and now it randomly stopped. So I was just, you know what, it's time to go talk to a camera and post it on YouTube because why not? And here I am, it's the end of the day, it's like 6 p.m. I would say, I'm not sure. I never know what time it is, thankfully. I don't like knowing what time it is. If it's dark, then it's night. If it's light, then it's day. I don't care about anything else, you know. But I'm having just a chill last time. I went to a family lunch from my boyfriend's family, not my family, but I guess it's the same family because I'm his girlfriend. I don't know, man. I went to a family lunch. I don't like family lunches, but I enjoyed this one. It was actually quite pleasant. The food was delish and we had a view to the ocean, so banger. I loved it. So yeah, I also cleaned my car yesterday, like washed it, vacuumed it, passed like a, this thing have this this is my cleaning kit I love this thing I buy it at a random gas station I always buy this thing it smells like lemon and I just you know clean my whole car with this it smells really good and then I also bought something new which was this scent I honestly bought it because the packaging was so cute this is a glass can you hear it anyway so I just like spray my car with this cigarette smell is gone and I also leave my windows open because, I don't know, I don't really love when my car smells a lot like cigarettes. I used to enjoy it a little bit more, now I don't, I'm kind of done with it. So yeah, I don't know, I love the smell of the cigarettes, but sometimes when it's enclosed inside my car, it's a little bit too much. But either way, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and knowing how much I spend on cigarettes, you noisy people, nosy, nosy when you're like nosy to know something? Is that an expression? I don't know. But either way, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all very soon. Bye.